we are talking at home techniques that you can use to help with tailbone pain. So if you're having a little bit of discomfort in this general area, these are some techniques that you can use. So taking your ball, you're going to have your arms on it. You're going to sit back and sink towards one side. This is going to open up your entire glute area up into the side of the fascial areas that connect right to your tailbone to give you some relief in that area. Of course, we want to do both sides. So sinking in on the ball just to open up both sides here. Second technique, we're going to sit on our ball and we're going to do some figure fours. We're going to go front back side side just to loosen off the pelvis and we can even do figure eights as well to try to loosen off the pelvis and open up that area for the tailbone. Third exercise, you can take your chair and a tennis ball and there's a sacral tuberous ligament right underneath the bum that you're going to sit on in that area. It can be pretty tender so just be mindful of that. You're going to open up your leg and then close just to try to get a little bit of pressure on that sacral tuberous ligament to loosen off to give you some relief for that tailbone. Of course with this one you might find that one side is more tender than the other so we want to make sure that we do both just to try to release that pressure off that area. So those are some techniques that you can do at home to help with tailbone pain. In office, what we're going to do is, if you are 30 weeks and beyond, we're gonna do Webster techniques so we will access that sacral tuberous ligament. So depending on what side is your Webster side, we're gonna dig in with our thumb right underneath here and we're gonna hold for about 30 seconds to a minute depending on what your body needs. We can also use a drop piece to adjust the sacrum, which is this bone, this triangle bone right in this area that connects right to your tailbone. We call this all the tailbone because it's all connected. So by utilizing the drop piece, we can pull down and then adjust it through that way. Or we can put you in side posture. So Steph, you can turn and face me. So by getting her into side posture, we're able to contact directly on that sacrum and then adjust her this way as well.